Well, how do there, chums? Tis I, Captain of the Steves, and today, chums, I'm back in No Man's Sky, and I've been looking at how well I'm doing with the autophage. And you know what? I think I'm doing better than I thought I was. Let me just jump on it and make the screen a little bit bigger, and I'll show you what I mean, people in the viewerverse. So, yeah, over here, yes, I've got 426 words learned. There's something like 600 and something got words to be learned, so... I'm almost there, just another 200 or so words to go. Considering that you can learn a fair few words doing the missions, that's quite good. Now I have actually reached Ambassador, the highest medal achieved for doing missions. The auto fade repairs. I want to see whether I can just do the repairs without doing the missions, because technically I don't have to do the missions. However, any repair auto fade ones I might as well pick up, because I might learn some words doing it. So I'm thinking, only do the autophage repair missions, all the other missions, just not bother with. And the void harvesting, <clears throat> yeah, the radiant shards collecting, I've got 167 now. The next milestone is 175. I don't know what the highest milestone is for that one, so I'm just going to carry on doing that. So I'm thinking, go to a dissonant system, just hit on up autophages, do as many repairs as possible, and yeah, and, and maybe just learn a few more words. So it's only these three I've got to do now. I've actually done those two. Those two are maxed, which is great. Awesome. Now with the outlaws, I've been looking there. I've only got to do a couple of outlaw missions, but I'll be doing that at some other stage. I mean, you can see there, it took me until I hit about the 80 mark that it went to the highest level. So that's quite a lot of missions to do for the outlaws. Anyway, so I'm just going to be pushing on with that, people, in today's episode. So, I'm still learning the Gek. I've just debriefed my frigates. I haven't debriefed these ones. Let's see if we get one of those sort of sacks that expands inventory. Let's see. Superconductor. Nope. Organic cyst. Psychnotic egg. Psychnotic egg. But no sack. No. The sacks seem to be as rare as rocking horse turd people inside of the view of us. They really do. Anyway, let's head on down. Let's see if either of my frigates, well, I'll say either, I've got three of them, have now become S-Class. Let's go and have a look, see, shall we? We'll do a two-hour one combat mission, and we'll select all of my vessels. Oh! Oh, oh, oh! It looks like one of them has become an S-Class, so I only need to send out the flumps and the visionaries. Does that give a five-star rating? It freaking does. Away you go, my pretties! Yeah, so one of them is now S-Classed, people. That's pretty darn sweet. You know what, I'll send out um, one of these ones, and I'll just send a load of the organic sort of frigates out, and we'll see if they come back with anything, people, when it comes to the sacks. There you go, I'll send all of those. Go! Fly, fly, fly! Boom! They're off. All right, there you go, peeps. Right, well, I'll hit up a save, and then I'll find a planet inside of a Gek Dissonant system, and we'll be flying down to the Gek Dissonant planet. OK, I'll show you what I find anyway in a moment, people. OK, chums, well, it looks like we've found this one. New Islamanans, or something like that. And yes, it's Solarium Fari planet. There's no other dissonant in this system. There is a lovely ringed ancient bowl... Well, ancient bones planet, and it's so, you know... Star Bramble. Anyway, um, I digress. We're heading down to the dissonant planet, though, people. That is Lamamans or something there. Okay, well, let's head on over to his Lamamans. Let's go, let's go. And flying out. In fact, I'm going to go to the station first. We're going to learn some Gek in the station. I'll see you at the station. Okay, well, let's fly on up and let's start learning some Gek. Let's see how much Gek language I know already, first of all. Let's go and have a little quick look-see. So I know 882 words. I've been told that there's just sh just over 900 words for the Gek, so I've got work to do. I thought I was getting fairly close to the end, but someone hit me up and said, no, it's about 919 or something mental like that that I've got to learn. So let's go talk to all these little Gekky guys. And yeah, I think you get the idea of what I'm doing. I'm just talking to each and every single one, saying request dialect help. Mystery symbol, learning a word. Thank you, ass peeps. I'll let you know if anything weird happens. Okay, well, I'm touching down on planet Islamamans. Here we go, let's uh, jump on out. Lovely jubbly. Let's run on up to this post. Let's have a quick look to see if there's any of those little roustabouts about. Echoes, are you here? Yes, they are. Hello there, my little echoey chums. Let's go chat to the echoes. Right, so practice language. Learn a word. Echoes, might as well learn a word. Trade symbol, why not? Go speak to the same chap again. 
This time, hit on up the mission. Let's see if the mission is going to offer any words. Ah, autophage words free, so it's worth doing that. So start mission. There we go. I've already got all of those anyway, so I might as well visit him and hand in those radiant shards. There we go. And I'm going to learn four words just from doing that, which is pretty darn cool. Okay, let's go talk to the other guy in the chair. Hello there, mate. Okay, got you. And practice language. Cool. Request dialect help. Get myself a trade symbol. Talk to him again. Let's see if he offers a mission that's going to give me some words. Offer assistance. Collect four radiant shards. Autophage standing. Void moats. What's the other reward? Let's have a look. Autophage words times three. Now, when I was on creative mode, I was only getting times two. But it does look like I'm doing a bit better. So here we go. Let's turn that in. Learning a lot more words than I thought I'd be earning people there. Let's talk to this guy. Hello there, mate. Julio. Practice language. Request dialect help. Cool. Aggression symbol. Now let's talk to this guy again. Let's see what mission he has. Are you going to be teaching me autophage words? Autophage words times two. So, yeah, not all of them do times three, but I do it anyway because I've got chromatic metal on me. Boom. Hand that in. Lovely jubbly. Hmm. I'm going to put it back into creative mode and see if I get any that offer me three. Because, you know what? Why the fudge not? Because then I'm not spending all my resources. Might as well. It makes no freaking odds to me. Yeah, let's go on over. As long as I'm learning two to three words, that's still good. Practice language. Quest dialect help. Get one word from him. And get back in. Come on. Yes, I would like to do you a mission, sir. Auto page standing. Void moats. And times three. It does give you times three words. Doesn't matter, people. So there we go. Oh, looks like I've got a phone call. It's one second, peeps. Okay, well, I've visited all of those people and none of them offered me the repair autophage mission. But you know what? I'm wondering whether I can just repair an autophage without doing the mission and whether it adds to the counter, people. So, you know what? Let's give that a try. So let's just hit on up another autophage camp and let's just hope that it's got a autophage that needs repairing by it people let's go and have a look see i'm just blasting a couple of radiant shards while i'm here as well let's see how we get on okay where's it pointed me it's pointed me to another location which is great i'll see you over at that location okay well the location it's taken me to it doesn't look like there's any autophages that need repairing so that's a bit of a shite isn't it but yeah you get that from time to time some sites do have autophage to repair others don't so hopefully I'll get a, a repair autophage mission here. Let's have a look and see if there's any sort of knowledge stones around here. What just happened there? Ted Lieutenant just subscribed. Thank you there, Ted. Very kind of thee. Probably butchered your surname, but thank you, Ted. I'm not seeing any knowledge stones around by close proximity, but that's not a matter. Anyway, I'll continue with the autophages. I'll speak to you in a bit, people. Well, chums, I've completed one repair autophage mission. Let's see if I can complete this next repair autophage mission. Um, okay. No, there he is. Okay, I, I think I've already done it then. Okay, there you go, buddy. Uh, yeah, done that. Let's have a look, see how we're doing now. So if I go over to the autophages. Okay, the Gek language, we're on 888. But there we go. Autophage is complete. Ah, it's still going. It's moved up. It's moved up to 25 now. 20 or 25. So I've still got to repair another five and see what happens then. I don't know what the highest medal is there. Words learned. We're getting close to 500, but we've still got a way to go. Shards. I've shot a couple more, but I'm nowhere near the 200. So yeah, there's a lot more gallivanting to do. I'll see if we can get to the next milestones and then reconvene. Okay, chums, I'm doing what I normally do when I got a little bit bored of talking to autophages, and I'm hitting up knowledge stones and also zapping radiant shards as I go. So that's 245 views. As I'm on my way there, I'm just keeping an eye out for knowledge stones on the way. But yeah, there's not an abundance of knowledge stones on this planet yet again. They seem to be sparsely sort of spread. So yeah, hopefully we'll find some more though. I mean, yeah, you just saw me hit up one, so they are about. 
Um, I've hit two up so far, people. But they're not as irregular as these radiant shards. Heck no, they're not. But there we go. I'll lock onto the next batch of radiant shards. Head on over. Now, sometimes those knowledge stones just don't render in as quickly as they once did before, people. So I'm just keeping an eye out because it, you can't really overly really trust your scanner. All right, anyway, we'll head on over to these radiant shards. But you know the drill, people. I've been doing this for the last couple of episodes now. If I do manage to get some, I manage to get some. If I don't, I don't. But I will probably go to a trading post later on and also a relic site and also a, uh, what a monolith. Okay, chums, I just visited a trading post. You can see it over there in yonder distance. Heck yes, just went there, spoke to a load more gek. And I've had a bit of an idea, peeps. So I've been picking up these. I haven't got many of them. But don't they do something? Don't these sort of like hit on up an echo camp? No, it's not those. What about these? Are these the ones that stick it up? I don't know. Mm, search archive. Let's see what it does. Does it find sentinel ships, this one? If it does, there's a broken frickin' autophage there anyway, isn't there? Let's go and see if that counts as fixing an autophage, people. Just out of interest, because I could just hit up a load of those and get a load done. All right, well, let's uh, call in my shipty ship. Let's go and have a look, see, people. Let's see if this blinking works, because, yeah, I could just duplicate them and go and fix a shed load of autophages and get that done like lickety split. Ha 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 ha! Let's see if it works, sneaky and sneaky. Let's go, 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 go. Yep, let's go. Yeah, um, and yeah, I'd let you know, people. We'll have a look. Right, so I'm landing at this sentinelized ship. Let's see if this works. Right, so here's my damaged autophage chum, just here, this little guy. Let's just go in, let's check uh, my log. Bum, bum, bum. Autophage is repaired. I'm on 20. 20 of 25. Let's see if this works then. Chikapow. It's not as broken as the other ones, is it? I don't know whether this is going to count, thinking of it. Let's have a look. If it did, I'd be surprised. Auto page. 21! It did! It freaking worked! Okay, right. Well, at least I can do that in each system. You know, and I could always just now clear this one off, couldn't I? Go into the logs. Uh, this one, abandon mission, don't really need that. Cool, yeah. I wonder if hitting it up again, whether it's going to work. Oh, look, I can also use these to find echo camps, can't I? Why haven't I been doing this before? This would, this would make things a heck of a lot easier, wouldn't it? There we go, found a harmonic camp. I can just jump over there, fix... Fix a K to frickin' autophage and probably pick up another mission. Alright, let's go do that then. Heck yes. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, nice. Okay, so these harmonic camps, these are a lot bigger than the usual sites that I go to as well. And they've usually got a little guy that I can repair here. Let's see if this moves it up to 22 then, people, shall we? Mm, cool, yeah. There we are. Feed it lost circuits. Done. Let's just go and have a quick look, see if that worked. Autophage. No, that one didn't work. What's the actual flying fudge? Let's try that again. Okay, I guess that one's not as broken as others. What the actual heck? All right, well, let's scan these guys then. Okay, well, I figured, you know, bigger camp, more echoes. But no, we've got we've got two little guys walking. Three, three guys, three guys walking around. Okay, fine. Let's go talk to him then. All right, well, that didn't work, but the broken centralized ships does. Now, technically, people, I could do the little query that's over here. Is it this? Is this it? Where you have to do the like, little mass puzzle? Here we go. Let's have a go. Input the scan memory registers. Registers, right. Uh, 14, 4, 14, 4, 14, 4, 7, 8, 9, 10. 14, 4, 10, 14, 4, 10, 14, 4, 10, 14, 4, 10, 14, 4, 10, 14, 4, 10, 14, 4, 10, 14, 4, 10, 14, 4, 10. Okay, come on then. Well, I'm going to blink and forget it if you're not bloody quick enough. Not for fudge sake. Okay. 14, 4, 10. So 4, 14, and 10. There we go. 
Locate dissonant spikes. That should give me another broken sentinel ship, I think. And if it does, and it's not the same one, I'll find another auto page there, won't I? So that kind of works out. So one, it helps me find an autophage that's broken. And also I can do some autophage missions, learn some autophage words. So that's kind of working. I wish I'd done this sooner. That would have um, got me done a lot quicker, wouldn't it? But there we go. That's it is what it is, people. That's uh, flying over here. Now, I don't know how many Sentinel ships there are per planet. So this could be taking me back to the one that I was already at previously. So it might be worth just doing the echo camps rather than using up all of my sort of Sentinel ship locators. And use those for if I ever need a Sentinel ship. It takes you straight there without no messing about doing maps. Anyway, let's fly on down and let's see if this is the same ship as before. Hopefully it's not. There's some buildings over there as well, weren't there, people? Pretty darn nice. Okay, we've got a ship. I don't know whether it's the same or not because I didn't pay any interest to what the ship looked like before, people. Let's just hope it doesn't say Visitard. Let's go and have a look. Meow. Don't know whether it isn't. No, we're good. No, this is a different one. Okay, well, will this take us up to 22 then? It should do. Sweet. Let's go into here. And the autophage. 22. Heck yes. Done. Yeah, it's going to take me a while to get to 25, though, and see what the next milestone is, people. It's going to be 30, obviously, isn't it? It's not going to say maximum reached. But how am I doing now, anyway, on freaking words? Because I've done loads. 486. Oh, my God. It takes ages. I only have to do another six shards to see if I get the top medal on that, though. I'm just going to go and shoot six shards, and I'll be right back with you. Oh, actually, what I could do while I'm here, though, is just hit this up and see if there's any other echoes around. Oh, there's not. What the fudge? Normally there's a couple of echoes wandering around these areas, isn't there? No echoes around this ship. Okay. All right, people. Well, I go shoot those shards and I'll be right back. People, I've just hit 200 radiant shards. In fact, 202. And it says, highest medal achieved. I no longer need to shoot Atlantean shards or radiant shards or whatever they are. This is brilliant. Okay, well, let's just hope that's the same sort of thing for fixing freaking autophages let's hope that when i hit 25 it says highest medal achieved then that means we haven't got much left to do but anyways um, let's go find another echo camp then shall we echo bitch down 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 okay i'm not far from where the last one was so let's just hope it finds me a brand new one okay i'll be right back with you people well, chums, I'm just flying towards the ringed planet. It's got no... Well, it has got some water on it, I think. But yeah, I'm going to be hitting up a trading post here to speak to some more gek. And I'm also going to hit on up a crash sentinel ship here to fix one more auto page to see if 25 is the top tier. Because I'm on 24 auto pages of that 25. And we'll see if it does move to 30. I'm hoping it doesn't, because then that just means we can focus on learning the auto page wordage. But anyways, I've broke the atmosphere of this planet, and it, isn't it wonderful? It's looking quite nice. Let's just hit on up a trading post. I'll see you at the trading post, people. Okay, we only need to learn five more words, and that takes us up to 900 words of the Gek learned. So let's hopefully get that little milestone ticked over. So here we go, request dialect help. Yes, mystery symbol, that's all I've got left to go. Hello there, mate. Oh my god, he's got dead eyes! Like black-eyed children. If you haven't heard of the MIP, black-eyed children, it's freaking freaky. There we go, let's go talk to this little chappy. Nice one. Hello there, mate. Learning some more words. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Got you. Um, how are we going to get five? I mean, I think that's this is going to be the fourth, isn't it? But hopefully we get one more. Sweet. Is there one more for one more? Not in that corner. Over in this corner there's one. Hopefully he doesn't offer to become a worker at my base. Let's see. Are you going to let me learn a word? You are! Brilliant. That should hit us up to 900 words of the gag learned. Let's just go see if that's the case. Yes, we now know 900 words. I've been told that there's about 919 or something around that sort of count. So hopefully by next episode we'd have that done auto pages i want to go and hit on up and see if that triggers over but you can see here i'm on 532 words learned now it's doing pretty good highest medal on that so we've achieved that this episode at least people it feels like we're making good progress it's slow progress but it's still good progress isn't it 
How are we looking for knowledge stones on this planet? Oh look, there's there's two knowledge stones in close proximity. And another one just over there, and another one, and another one. This planet is rich in knowledge stones, people. I'm going to gallivant around and just learn all the freaking geck words on this planet. Why the heck not? We'll go and hit up all of those in close proximity. Wow, we might learn all the geck language in this episode, people. You know what? Let's uh, hit this. Bang. There's also um, ancient bones on this planet as well, people. So, you know, this might be a fairly good planet for doing that. Well, look, there's another one just right here. Pow. Go over here. Here's another one. Sweet. If there wasn't a storm right now, I might even spot more. There's an abundance of them. Look, they're everywhere. Heck yes. This is like one of those planets that I mentioned, peeps, are really good for finding knowledge. Chikapow. There's one over there. Sweet. And also there's a dissonant planet in nearby proximity. So this might be a good planet for you guys to come to to learn your geck. And also hit up Radiant Shards on the other planet because they were in abundance there. Okay, any more for any more? Yeah, look, there's one just there. So it looks like they're just... 300 years apart roughly or there or thereabouts you know what i'm just going to do this for the next like 10 15 minutes and see if we can top out the gag because why the fudge not it'd be nice to get that freaking done wouldn't it all right uh let's hit that then how freaking awesome any more yeah there's one right there 300 years away brilliant planet for doing this people so if you do want to come here i give you the coordinates here you go Chikapow! There you go, bottom left corner, right there. Double bird, double beetle, a Sunday set, a bird, a diplo, and a waypoint. Last four, a voxel, a boatman boat face, a reflection, and another boatman boat face. Heck yes, people inside of the view of us. Well, let's just head on over here. Let's hit another knowledge stone. And you know what? I'll reconvene in a bit. Hold on, what was that over yonder hill? Was that another trading post that I just spotted? No. Yes, it is. It's another trading post. Awesome. Well, we can go and speak to the freaking Gek up here. And you know what? That might freaking do it, mightn't it, people? Let's go and see if that's the case. Heck yes, unless this is the one that I just came from and I'm just... It hasn't got my ship on it, so there must be two trading posts right by each other. So luck be had it, people. All right, well, let's go speak to this little guy. Hello there, mate. How are you? Swedes, request dialect help. It's not greyed out, so we're still going. Cool, one there. This little trap over here. Hello there, mate. Budge and Herc. Now, what word are you going to teach me? Dream. Yes, it's a bad dream. It's a freaking bad dream going around talking to all these guys. Quest dialect fun. Help. There we go. Boom. Path. I'm on a path to nowhere. Dun, 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 dun. Don't even know whether they're the lyrics, but they could be. Mysterious symbol, a cross. Hmm. Again, and this guy got nothing silly to say other than a cross. And what else we got? Go on, give me a silly word. Prefer. I'd prefer to be doing something else. Heck, yes, I would. Let's see, that's how it works. Okay, right. Well, we've done all those. What are we on now, Gek language wise? 912. All right, well, I keep going and I'll let you know what it caps out at, people. Okay, I just hit up a knowledge stone and it said nothing new learned. So here we go, let's hit again. Boom, see, nothing new. That means I've hit the cap, people. What was the cap? It's 912. 912 words of gag is the highest number. Yes, there we go. I've got the highest medal on everything now when it comes to gag. We've only got to do the Corvax, so we're going to be going to a Corvax system next time, people. And uh, yeah, I just want to do one more repair of the autophage. So let's just hit on up one of my sort of doohickeys for finding a sentinelized ship. It wasn't the anomaly detector. It looks like that, but it's like an angrier redder colour, this thing. We're going to do that. Oh, we've got another nine over there. That's good. Right, well, let's hit that then. This should find ourselves a sentinelized ship, and we know they count as autophage repairs. Lovely. So there we go, we've got our dissonant spike. I'll see you with a dissonant spike at the Sentinel ship. Hold on, it took us to the other planet. We might have already visited it. Maybe I should have waited till we got to another system in space. Right, well it's brought me in. I'm hoping this is a different one to what we've already seen, but it's back on that dissonant planet, so I'm a little bit nervous that it isn't. Okay, let's head on over. I mean, I can, cl I can duplicate the fudge out of these things that I've got, so... Doesn't only really matter if it's not. Oh no, it looks like it was another one to be repaired. Dedicated. Let's see if 25 is the maximum. I've got a horrible feeling it's not going to be, but we will see. 
There we go. So that's now repaired. Let's go see if it says high. It's done. Nope, it's moved to 30. I've got to repair 30 of them. Well, to be honest, if I'm hitting up these echo camps and I'm learning about three to well, two to three words per mission I do, and hoping that I get lucky. I mean, I was on 400 and something at the start of this video. We're now on 532 words. So doing these two in tandem, I don't think is too much of an ask now. And we've also got to learn the Corvax language, so I don't need to overly rush. All right, people, I think I'm good. All right, well, let's head on up to the freighter and let's see if my frigate missions are ready to debrief. But I don't think they are, people. But we shall see, I guess. Well, chums, we're back on my freighter bridge. They're not quite ready yet to debrief, but you know what? We can debrief them next episode. Next episode, we will be going to a Corvax system and learning the Corvax words, people in the view of us. Heck yes, we will. And also trying to hit on up the autophage. It'd be nice to hit 600 words on our next outing for the autophage, wouldn't it? And maybe hit 30 repaired autophages. That's kind of the get goal that I'm setting myself. And yeah, we'll be learning some Corvax. I know, it's riveting stuff. Until next time, goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again.